Hi, welcome to Wholeheartedly for the Lord Bible Journaling with Sherry. Today's process video is that time of the month again. It is the monthly setup for faith and daily planners that most of us YouTubers do each and every month to inspire you guys to possibly start one of your own or inspire you to do different things in your journals and in, I'm sorry, in your faith planners. This is my creative faith and company planner that Hillary was so gracious to send me. I love it. I've been working in it and it's just a joy to work in and I'll also be working in my new prayer planner which I will go more into a little bit later. Thank you for watching and remember if I can Bible journal so can you. Take care. Just to do a quick flip through here I'm reading through the Bible with my church and I fell behind during vacation with the reading so I was doing the current reading and some of the back reading that I missed to try to stay on point. And I will continue to put in the monthly calendars in this section. And then I have my June layout. That's when I got this planner actually. And I did my layout for June and that was fun to do. And I had to get used to the size of this planner working in it, but it was really fun and uh, a good challenge for me. And there I'm keeping record of um, beautiful good news because I do PR for them. So I have to have a certain amount up. So I wanted to make sure that I meet those each month. And I'm starting to put that in my mini planner as well. And then I thank you guys. If you've seen my July setup, you've seen how much I botched that up. And now I'm going to work on my August and then there's a weekly section and here it is and again what I like about this planner I've said this before is that it looks handmade it is handmade and I didn't have to do it but it has that handmade look so I just decorate the left side with a list of things that I may need to do and um, check them off during the week and then on the right side are the dates where it's not a lot of space but I did try to utilize the space as best as possible so I'll also be doing my weekly setup on this section right here. So let me speed this up and let's see how this goes.
here is my planner my prayer planner that I've been working in it's a 20 20 and 2021 planner that I bought mid year and so I put down some of the stores that I buy from the Etsy shops and some of the kits that I need to use that I have a lot of and I want to make sure I use so I'm keeping track of it right here in the front I'm breaking this planner up into sections this section here will be my prayer section where I pray for my husband and my son as I've said in another video and then praises and prayers of adoration and you'll see some completed pages with those shortly and then here is the self-care section just a small section because I have changed my self-care plan into a digital one and I'll be doing a video on that one to explain why don't judge me and so this right here I love working out so that's my physical self-care and then here is my and then I have medical self-care which you know taking care of all of your appointments and what you need to do for your physical health and well-being and then here is like my spiritual soul health right here where I have scriptures and fruit of the spirit and different kits like hunt and seek creative this is I choose from Max Locato which we say at our church every Sunday before the pandemic and now we do it online and then also one day I'm going to come back and read this this is from Samantha read Gloria expressed in creative journaling she did a fruit of the spirit but it was for health and self-care and it's awesome so I want to take out a specific video to do something on that and read that with you but I put it in here and I hole punched it of course with my planner punch and then <clears throat> excuse me and then I decorated the top and here we go with some more scriptures pertaining to walking in the spirit and the things of the spirit which I will be doing sections on that for my spiritual self-care um, just different little kits and reminders of um, renewing my mind in the Lord and then this section here is praying with and for others and um, had I thought about it I would have put this in the beginning with the other prayer section but that's okay but these are kits like the faithful heart shot kit on power of praying partners and then different things with prayer and then I've shown you this before these are all the books of the Bible from the store and I am keeping track of it and so now I'm going to go into my August section and oh here's the flip through of the adoration pages and I use different kits from print pray and slay and praise and pray and beautiful good news um, just to kind of beautify those praying pages and I'm just going to fill those in with prayers for people and scriptures supporting prayer and um, I left some empty and I'll fill those in as time goes on you just saw a kit from Robin Sampson as I stated with a bunch of other extras from different shops and then I just filled in some note pages and I left these pages in. What I've done was on the sides they had the month, days of the month, days and the months of the year and I cut it off but I do like the dashboards for each section like those and so I decided to keep those and just cut off the, the title of the month and I'm going to keep those sections because I'm just going to fill it with different kits and things like that and then here we are back in June and some notes in June, July and then here's August and now I'm going to start just having a prayer for the beginning of the month and then that's the setup for the month of August and you'll see that process right after this and this week August 9th is my birthday week so I'm going to do a separate video for that. I decided that I didn't like the boxes and the white out on the boxes so I just took some notebook paper some happy planner notebook paper and I covered up those boxes with the, the notebook paper and now I'm just going to decorate the page for the first week in August and uh, thank you guys for watching hope you were inspired and encouraged by these videos and my attempts to reconstruct and deconstruct things and I just thank God for feeling better too because all week I was sick and I'm just feeling better still a little congested and a little in pain but other than that I am doing great I thank God for just feeling better amen so have a great one and take care bye